Hi, Rob here from SkidsterSolutions.com. I just want to show you what to expect when you receive your Etera auger equipped with a flip hitch. So for shipping ease, what they do is they take both sides of the auger and they nest it together. But what we're going to do here is we're going to, just going to take it all apart here so I can show you exactly how everything works. So the first thing you'll see is this is the top hitch. This is the part that's only used when you're running the cement mixer bowl. So generally you're going to actually just take this right off. You're not even going to use it when you first get your auger. Take that off, you leave the pins with it, and now what we're going to be concerned with is just the standard portion of the hitch here, and it's actually upside down. So what we want to do is just remove it as well, and all we're going to do is turn it around, and we'll put our pins back in. Put our clips back in. And then we'll take our auger out and we'll install it onto the onto the dog bone. But this is the standard configuration that you should be using this auger in, in in most applications. Okay, so let's talk about the top bracket. With the auger installed here, it normally would sit in this rest. But when we want to run the cement mixer bowl, what we actually want to do is we want to be able to lock the auger in place. So how we do that is we have this top bracket. Again, this bracket is only used for the cement mixer. You slide it down into place here. Install our pins. Put our clips on. And now this has the auger drive sitting in the middle here, so it's going to be locked in place. Now what that enables us to do is we can spin this around so that it's facing up at a 45 degree angle so we can install our cement mixer bolt. And here's how we do that. So I've just loosened the bolts off here just to make things a little bit faster. Basically we remove these four bolts. We still got the main bolt holding it in place here. Pivot around. Install our four bolts. Okay, because that's going to hold it in place. and we're good to go. If you have any questions on this or any other attachments offered on our website, you can contact us through skidsteersolutions.com.